Live at the Black Lives Matter March, my name is Donovan Lee and I'm here with Coach Jimmy Elgis, the head coach of the Men's Reddish basketball team. So Coach, what does the term BLM or Black Lives Matter mean to you? Well, it means a lot, especially um, I think a couple of different reasons with what's going on you know, in this country right now. It obviously means a lot because as we've talked about to our players and to the people that we come in contact with, there has been uh, a lot of wrong. There's systemic racism that enough's enough. And it's been a perfect storm for a lot of things to come together for um, a lot of change to be promoted and action to be taken. And so I think on a, a national scale, it's really um, exciting. It's really, if that's the right word, it's really, um, we're really happy to be a participant to try to invoke true change. And the second part is, you know, we've got a lot of guys on our team and as we've talked through the through the years, they have stories, they have experiences where they experience racism and they experience uh, inequalities. And we stand with our guys, shoulder to shoulder, um, with with them to promote change, to get it done. And all our entire teams registered to vote. Our entire teams doing what we need to do uh, to promote change, right where we're at, and hopefully it resonates, you know, throughout the country. And I'm here with Logan Wetterling. So Logan, what does the term BLM or Black Lives Matter mean to you? It means to me creating an environment where everyone is treated right and everything is kind of where you think it's supposed to be, mm -hmm. but it's not. And BLM is that progress to getting to that point. Okay. Do you think we've made any progress since the start of this social injustice? I would like to think so, especially with, we have brought so many people out here today and even our coaches sent us emails and said, cause I'm on the swim team, told us, hey, come out here and support this movement. And I saw people that I didn't expect would come. So I think we're all as a country changing our mentality slowly but surely. Okay. We're here at the Black Lives Matters March and I'm here with Charles Craig II. All right, so Charles, tell us what you do on campus as far as, as uh, civil rights goes. Well, I'm actually a part of Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated. Uh, I'm a part of Angelic Voices Christ. Uh, just kind of be a lending hand on campus. I'm just, a, I guess we want to call it Big Brother on campus. Okay. So what does the term BLM or Black Lives Matter mean to you? It means basically equality for all. This equality for peace and justice uh, of the right kind. And it's not, not about the Marxist group. It's just for peace, for peace all around in the world. So yeah. How do you feel this election is gonna is gonna change the way we we see things that, uh, from here on out? Uh, I think this election is really important with the rhetoric that's going on in the country, and you can hope that whatever happens is for the better, and that the people go out and vote and register to vote and make sure your voice is heard. You have any words for the student body and faculty here at Henderson? Henderson, you know I love you. Uh, just keep being equal and keep showing the world that we are an equal university and we have equality for all.